Hello, I am Nika Harper, and I wrote a story for my new episode of Wordplay. Just a general short story. I call it Tories. They call the place Tories. The fact is, nobody's seen Tory for years. Hardly anyone remembers why, anyway, but our famous dessert is named after her, and one of our special cocktails, although that recipe changes every so often. It's always new customers, anyway. It's a touristy town, and our name shows up in a lot of guidebooks. Not really a place where you would find regulars, no matter how good the pie tastes. And it's some good pie. I've kept my figure and my smile. That's enough for most of us. And I've been here so long, they all joke that I should own the place. Sometimes I wonder if I should too. I just can't think of anywhere else that needs me like this place does. I'm not special. Not by a long shot. But Tories is. Don't even know what the end of the name is. Tories, what? Cafe? Restaurant? Flea circus? Just becomes Tories after a while. It's been here a long, long time too. If it outdates me, well, it's doing something right. It's my last day, and nobody seems to believe it. I know it isn't customary, but I took the early shift so I could focus on the afternoon. And to say the service suffered today would be about right. I focused, but nobody else did. We'll name a drink after you next, Harold calls from the bar, passing me tiny sampler glasses of a new drink every time I clean the guest beverages. The new version seems to be a slightly sour Mai Tai. wonder what that says about me. I'm old as a fixture here. I'm old as the walls that keep this place up. I could look out the windows and tell you if it'll rain by the way the sun hits the nearby buildings. I've towered over this city for years. And I might miss the view. Yeah. Maybe for a moment or two. I know I'm leaving. I know it for sure. I don't know how long, but I don't need to. They held a little party for me in the back, tried to give me a tiara for my shift, a little card with all these names on it. Great people, good names, we all really mean it. I could miss them if I tried, but a few minutes of freedom is worth it, I'd say. I'll be back in the swing of things before I know it. Even if the drinks are inconsistent, Tories has been one of the most constant things in my life. The doors and how they creak, Smells of this place, it really is home. It's comforting for me. Which nobody else might believe if they've worked in food service. It isn't all roses. Sometimes it's carnations, and you gotta make them look like roses. I liked them just the same, and I can sell them twice as fast. That's food service for you. Yeah, such a sour Mai Tai. I smile at Harold. He's a good sort. You gonna say goodbye to the fish? My smile gets wider. The fish have names. This fancy aquarium is full of them, but really only a hearty few stick around. The big purple one is Milloway. The beaked one is Pony. There's Magnolia and Tiffany. And the little blue guys are Cauldron, Broomstick, and Hog. The names don't really matter. They won't notice I'm gone, I tell him. Yeah, but the rest of us will. After some hugs and a brief stoppage in food delivery, I walk to the elevator doors with a tiara in my hand and the other finger dragging across the aquarium where the fish follow my movement. My last day. Enjoy it. Just for a minute. There she is. The new girl. I almost bump into her as she heads onto her shift. She apologizes to hide how mortified she is. She'll do great at this place. Like I never left. The elevator doors glad shut in front of me like they've done so many times. I hope this break is worth it. The uniform still feels rough around my neck. Like I haven't grown into it yet. We were just celebrating, Harold says at the bar. Remind me to give you a drink I made up today. But I'm off my shift, sir. He smiles a little too long as I clock in behind the swinging doors and stash away my purse. One of the cubbies is conspicuously empty, so I just take that one. First day at the hostess booth all by yourself, Carleen says, looking both dubious and proud. I log in once with the wrong number, correct myself, type in the new one I've had a week to memorize. Hope you get to make friends with fish, Carleen says. They supposedly have names, but I can never remember. Slide my finger across the glass. Fear the fish trailing it. 
like always. We'll get along just fine, I think. Yeah, it's like I never left. Thank you so much for listening and dealing with my slightly southern acts. I have no idea how that happened, by the way. <laughs> sort of started happening and then it just went with it. Apparently they're in the south. Sort of. Um, if you liked that, you can read along with it on my Tumblr and be sure to watch the wordplay episode that it corresponds with so you can see what inspired this to happen. Of course, neither of these things would be possible if it wasn't for my Patreon, so please consider supporting uh, artists as they do what they love. It means the world to us. Thank you so much. So tell me what you think on all the social medias and all of those things. Please just share. Thank you.